How to use the .NET Nuke File Manager. This tutorial assumes that you have already logged in to the .NET Nuke admin area. Now let's learn how to use .NET Nuke built-in file manager. The file manager is used to administer existing files or upload new files from your local computer to the website. Scroll down. Scroll over admin. Then click file manager. Scroll down. This is the built-in file manager, and it is here where you can upload files to your website, delete them, change their permissions, create new folders, and many other functions. Let's navigate inside portal root folder here. Let's see what main operations with files can be performed through this file manager. To create a new folder, let's type its name here. Then click Add Folder. Success! The new folder has just been created. Now let's see how to copy files to the chosen location. Scroll right. Select the file by checking this box. Then click Copy Files option. Select the destination folder. Click OK to confirm the file's copying. That's it! The selected file has been successfully copied to the destination folder. Now let's see how to upload a file to our website. Click Upload option. Scroll down. Click Choose File to locate the file we're going to upload. Select the necessary file and click Open. Then click Upload File. Here is the file that we've just uploaded. Now let's see how to delete the file from our website. Select the file by checking this box. Then click Delete Files. Click OK to confirm the removal. The selected file has been successfully removed. Now let's try to set permissions for the selected test folder. Scroll down. Here you can assign view and write permissions for different user roles. Let's allow full access for registered users. Click Update when done. This is the end of the tutorial. You should now be more familiar with using DNN File Manager to upload copy files, create new folders, and set their permissions.